Hi and welcome back. In this lecture, we can talk about Key Insight 1, Accelerated Digital Transformation. So one of the positives of the COVID-19 pandemic is it accelerated the world's transition to a much more digital world exponentially. So all the industries started looking for digital solutions to support their business operations and to build a much more resilient businesses amidst very volatile environmental conditions. So there are a few innovative digital tools, technologies and techniques that the construction industry started adopting. The first is building information modeling. So BIM is basically a methodology which is supported by software. So lots of software support this and this is basically to increase collaboration and give the right tools, the right information at the right time to architects, contractors, builders, subcontractors and everyone to share and collaborate on a single source of truth. Because if you look at construction projects, it's very complex, there are lots of underlying tasks, everything needs to happen in a sequential order at the right time. So for example, you can't put a foundation for a building after the building is complete. So you need to do everything in a sequential manner the way it's supposed to do. And also what BIM enables is collaboration on a single source of truth. So what happens is there's no sharing of documentations, diagrams, version controlling and anything of that sort. So BIM will take over that process and ensure that the latest version is available for everyone to collaborate and work on. Next we'll see digital supply chains. So we're going to see a lot of digital technologies being incorporated into supply chains. So we can talk about this in one of our next lectures. So all these technologies will update real-time information about the location, weather, estimated time of arrival, estimated time of departure, There'll also be monitoring conditions which affect the delivery time. So things like traffic and weather and things like that. Next, we're going to see something called digital twins. So it's basically a digital representation of a physical project, which has real time data and information about the project. So this will greatly improve the health and safety as well as the operational efficiency of personal equipment and the entire building itself. And also, it will provide the ability to make more proactive and immediate decisions. So, it will alert the owner or the operator of the particular building about the potential risk, whether things break down, what are the bottlenecks and things like that. Then we'll also be seeing increased levels of autonomous robots. So, self-driving robots, moving goods here and there and also these robots will be specially used at high risk construction tasks like drilling. So this will greatly improve the productivity of the project, reduce health and safety hazards for personnel and things like that. Next we'll be seeing things like wearables. So the helmet that the workers are wearing will be smart. It's able to scan the environment, alert of potential dangers, maybe gas leaks, high temperatures and things like that and will also it will help to log valuable information like for example if a safety barricade is broken and things like that as well as ensure that occupational health and safety within the construction site is guaranteed and also we're seeing things like proactive maintenance so we'll be going from corrective maintenance which means basically fixing something when it breaks down to scheduled maintenance to having every equipment checked on a predefined timeline to proactive maintenance meaning using technology and other tools to understand and anticipate in a very accurate manner which component will likely to fail. So this will ensure greater business continuity, reduce unwanted costly scheduled maintenance activities and things like that. So that's about it for Key Insight 1. Accelerated Digital Transformation. I'll see you on another lecture.